Hello, everybody. Joe Marquez here once again from the Sons of Technology to showcase for you today four different ways that we can incorporate video into the Pear Deck platform. Now, Pear Deck is a great tool to be utilizing uh, uh, slide decks right out of Google Slides, and it allows us to get instant assessments from our students utilizing a variety of assessment tools. But we can also showcase videos for our students and then ask questions about those videos. Now, there is a little bit of a hack that needs to be done to incorporate a lot of these videos into your slide deck. And for this, what we're going to be using is the SRC Embed Hack. What that means is this, when you are on a website, there is an option most of the time to embed things that, that are videos into different platforms, such as our Pear Deck. But we can't install the entire iframe um, into our Pear Deck. What we need to do is look for the section that says SRC equals, and then the quotations. And then you're gonna see the, the letters HTTPS, you're going to highlight all of that until the very next quotation mark. So that's why we call this the SRC embed hack. So you're going to grab whatever's between those quotation marks. So how do we do this for YouTube? We're going to be inserting all of these videos using the website option here in Pear Deck. Now, let me show you what a lot of people do when they first try to put in a YouTube video. A lot of times people will click share they're on the right path. Then they're going to come down here and they're going to grab this URL. But if you paste that URL here, you're going to get the sad looking uh, page saying, sorry, it's not going to connect. So a lot of people think, oh, you can't install or embed YouTube videos into Pear Deck, but you actually can using the SRC embed hack. So here's our iframe. This is the embed code here. We're just going to grab the section right here in between those. And I'm going to paste it right here. And sometimes it grabs the whole thing. So all you have to do is come in and grab that HTTP all the way through the quotes. And as soon as we delete the rest, you'll now see that that video is available for us to view in that preview section. So that's how you can add Pear Deck with YouTube, but you can also add Looms into YouTube. If you've never used Loom, it's a great, quick and easy Google extension that allows you to record uh, your webcam, but also record your screen. So all you have to do is click the Loom icon, select your microphone and camera, and then hit start recording. And you can record a how to videos right off of your screen. And when you are done, recording on the Loom, it actually takes you right over here to the Loom website where your videos are hosted. First thing you want to do is make sure your video is set to public. So when they do get your link, they can view it. You're going to click the share option and there's your friendly embed code. You're not going to copy the code or preview the code. And you're going to grab that once again, that section in between the SRC quotations. We're going to come back here to our Pear Deck. We're going to click website. We're then going to paste that code right here where it asks us to place the website. Again, we're only going to grab the section between the SRC quotations, delete the rest. And we have our loom instantly embedded right in to our Pear Deck. What about Screencastify? I know a lot of people like loom, but a lot of people love Screencastify. Again, it's the same kind of tool that allows you to record your screen with a Chrome extension right off of your browser desktop. And when you're done recording it, you have the option here uh, to save it to your Google Drive. Um, or you can embed it as well. First thing, make sure you click that copy shareable link because you absolutely want to make sure that your video is viewable when somebody has access to it. Next, you're going to click that embed code. And again, you are going to copy that section after SRC equals, you're going to copy that code and we're going to come back right over here to our Pear Deck. We're going to click website once again, and we're going to paste that section of the embed code right here in, and there you go. You now see your screen castify video instantly added to your Pear Deck. 
Now, Flipgrid's going to be a little bit different because we do not need to use the SRC hack. In Flipgrid, what we do is we go to our grids, the grid that we want to install, we're just going to click share. And then from this, you're just going to copy that link right there. This one is super easy and super simple. We are again going to make sure we click on that website and I'm going to paste it in. And now you can see that you have the opportunity to see all your students' videos as they're recorded or your students can record right off of this. Now, here's another thing you can do because you can record videos on Flipgrid and you can screen record on Flipgrid. You can put all your screen recordings on here and maybe students can watch a sequence of videos, step-by-steps of lab tutorials or step-by-steps of how to do math problems that can be embedded here um, for students to view as well. I'm gonna go ahead and click update that site. And when you're done, you go ahead and click start lesson. And this is what your students will see. They'll see your presentation. And when they come to one of those embedded options, look, there is the video right here. And all you have to do is students hit play and they can watch that YouTube video right out of Pear Deck. What about our Loom? Our Loom video, you can see it's posted right there, ready to go. I'm going to click play. And boom, now you're off to the races. Now you're, yes, and boom, now you're off to the races. And then what about Screencastify? Same thing. There's our Screencastify. I click play. But yeah, you do your draw. So there's Screencastify. And finally, what about our Flipgrid? The Flipgrid is right here in our Pear Deck. You can watch other students' videos. Hello, everybody. This is Joe Mark. Or students can then record their responses right off of the Flipgrid. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, and if you do, make sure you go down there and you subscribe to our Sons of Technology YouTube channel. If you want to get a hold of me, please find me in the Twitterverse at Joe Marquez70 or tweet the Sons of Technology team at Sons of Tech EDU. Thank you so much for watching today. And hopefully, if this helps you out, please tweet it out and let me know that this video really helped you elevate your Pear Deck game. Once again, I'm Joe Marquez, and I hope you have yourself a wonderful wonderful day.